the purge. So, Windows 10. Let's talk about the theme. It's a theme. It It's blah. It's okay. Growing up, I had... I, I went through all the OS's. Windows 95, 98, 2000, Windows Me Edition. But the one that stand out the most was XP. And I really loved the theme. It was very nice, very clean, very simple. What if I told you we can go back in time and have our Windows XP theme? And it's simple. You just need two things and a little setup. So come along and let's convert our Windows 10 theme into a Windows XP theme, shall we? You're going to need two things. One, you're going to need Open Shell. This program here actually converts your Windows 10 theme to Windows XP. Now, what's nice is you, if you don't like the Windows XP theme, you can change it. You, we will download that. And make sure that you click Open Shell 4.4.160.exe. The second thing that you will need is the classic Shell XP suit for Windows 10. Now this gives you your background, your start button, because if you don't change it over, you're just going to get like a little shell. You'll see. Okay, but come on down, click here. Bada boom, bada beam. Okay, so go to where you've downloaded these on. It might be in your download file. Uh, for me, I got them on my desktop right now. We're going to go ahead and extract classic shell. Now, I'm using WinZip. Uh, you can use like any zip unzipper thing. And, but real quick, look at this folder. We have our start button, the bar. I think that's what it is. And bless. Okay, let's go ahead and run Open Shell. Did we just double? Okay. And we will follow our prompts. We will accept a license term. Bloop. And we will create a start menu folder. It will install this in C drive. Install. Yes. And finish. Now, I've already done this once. So there's a couple things still sticking around. But this is your Windows XP taskbar right here. Now, if you don't like this, or like you do like this, but you, you're still used to the Windows 10 start menu, just click this here. And it brings you your Windows 10 start bar. But anyways, we still got to do a little setup. So, open. Maybe open shell menu settings. That is what we need. So you have Windows 7 style, classic with two columns, and this classic. You can replace the start button. If not, it'll just stick with your normal start button there. The aura is your shell. You get classic or custom. Go to custom, pick your image, and make sure you pick the XP button. Then what we will do now is go to start button. Make sure that your start button image size is zero. And if it's, this is selected, go ahead and deselect because if not, it's going to align itself to the left, to the corner. So that might look okay on your system. Um, it didn't look right on mine, so that will be up to you. Okay, now taskbar. Custom taskbar. 
Do, 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 do. Taskbar texture. Go on to click here and click that right there. Make sure it's stretch, stretch. And you're all set there. Now, this is up to you if you wish to change any of things. I did not. Okay. And that's, that's pretty, oh wait, background. So for the background, what you gotta do is we'll just get out of this, right click, personalize, group, open up background. So we want a picture, we'll browse. Let's go to our desktop. Classic shell, bliss. And there you have your Windows XP desktop theme for Windows 10. The one thing that I really love about this is on Windows 10, when I go to shutdown, shutdown's in the middle. It should be, these two should be flipped around. But we don't have to worry about that anymore because we just hit shutdown. And it's right there for us. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Now, if you really want to have a nostalgia trip, go ahead and open up new window here. And we will go to Google Themes. Windows XP Luna. Oh, I had to enable. <laughs> there we go. Your Google Chrome is now Windows XPized. With that said, this was your. Oh, wait, I gotta show you something real quick. I almost forgot. Open oh, shell menu settings. Uh, select skit. So, this is where, if you want to change it to olive green or silver, you can do that as well. Ew. I don't like the silver. What does that green look like? I don't like that either. So we're going back to blue. So anyways, as I flip this back over to blue. There we go. That's fair. With that said, this was just a quick tutorial on how to convert your Windows XP, Windows 10 to Windows XP theme. That's a mouthful. That really is. Anywho, thank you for checking this out. Links are in the description. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, share with your friends, hit that bell for notifications. Until next time, we'll catch you later. See ya. I wonder if I can get pinball.